All right, done and done. Let me go on ahead and actually hop into practice and do some practicing myself, because I even know I also want to try to compete myself, so... Hey! Hey, welcome! Yeah! I'm, uh, gonna be here for a while until... If anything shows up, I might have to go, but I should Red be here for the whole thing. Okay. Uh, I guess I can commentate when the game starts. Alright, I appreciate it. Yeah, because honestly, I haven't seen it as um, Injustice 2 tournament in like two years since like before the whole pandemic stuff. So I'm ready. Uh, that's the same goes with a lot of people. They they haven't seen one in a while, so they're curious on how on like who's gonna show up for it. A yeah. lot of, a lot of people that do love playing the game are still out there. It's just a matter of just pitching an idea and seeing if they're interested. Get the contribution as much as necessary. That way you can get something going here. Pop a match Reno to it. Yeah. And we can get something going here. Because I haven't had a chance to ever be a part of one. And since I now have a little bit of clout in order to do something about it, I decided to go on ahead. Let's see if we can try and put one together. <sighs> yeah, that sounds like fun. I want to join too. Only problem is that my, my PS now recently ran out. That's why I couldn't play any more Red Dirt Redemption or nothing like that, because uh, oh, all my no. PS Now games are gone. Oh, wait, you're playing but, it through PS Now? Not not on disc? <laughs> yeah, I was playing it on PS Now since I had it um, installed. I mean, well, I had enough money at the time, but I haven't been able to, like, work up any... Uh, well, I had to put it into other things. Yeah. Oh, that's fair enough. I mean, as long as you got options when you when you're able to come online, then you got something to work with until you're able to get your P PlayStation Plus back up and running. Yeah. So, what games are <laughs> accessible to you right now that you are able to play? I honestly have way too many games because, like, I like playing games so much that, like, I go on to different games at different times. So this I have, is the like, fun part right now is to see what uh, games you can go into now that you don't have the PSN. You'd be surprised which ones you can get some access to or gives you half access to. Yeah, because I got, like, um, plenty of games that, like, were on PS Now now that I had bought before. So I can still play a lot of my games because some of them were games that are, were on PS Plus and then they went on. And when this does kick off, I'll take, um, uh, I take Cal L. I'll take Cal L and I'll take Hoodie Hound. And I'll take Ryder and Cheshire. And I'll take Ryder and Cheshire. And I'll take Cheshire. Oh, me, my bad. Never I, I, that. That, Where, that was, Cheshire I it sounds like a real familiar name. I know it's. I think it's a name in like like a history name. I don't. I don't know. That's what I've heard it. No, because everybody in the program here either has an FGC ish name or has a DC ish name. That's why I'm trying to think. Cheshire sounds real familiar. Like I want to say. Either Unlimited, Justice League Unlimited, or maybe Young Justice. I got it. I, I want to check. Cause Cheshire, that's a like if you're out there, that's a boss name. But I gotta check to see where that is, cause I know that's not the Cheshire Cat. Yeah, I looked it up. It's Cheshire Cat. Yeah. <laughs> Cheshire, Cheshire. I knew it! I knew I hadn't seen this heifer somewhere before. Bat boozing, she is she is from DC. She's a vil she's a she's a villainess from uh um from the Teen Titans era. Ah. Yeah, she's a love interest of Roy Harper. She's that she's that chick that um that Roy Harper was uh banged in uh Young Justice. Aw, oh, dang. I, I know I heard it, I've just like I can't remember at all. Yeah, later on when he became uh, Roy, that was uh, Speedy. Oh. The Red Arrow is what they should... Once upon a time, but he didn't call him Red Arrow. Or Arsenal, as he then became. But yeah, he's the he's a, he's a long rival to the Teen Titans. She, I, 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 don't, I wouldn't. I'm curious on how long she's been in the game because I've wondered if she has enough. If she has enough to match Slade's hour in, in trying to 
be like a huge supervillain against the team. Oh, that is you that I invited, right? That's the um the dude with the uh Yeah. You forgot to set it to competitive. Holy for holas. Dang. Get one job. Green Lantern. I'm just joking. Well, we can manually set it though. That's good. Red Hood. Oh, it's already about to start. Let's go. Alright. Like I said, you're going to be calling my match. Uh, for those of you guys that want to check bracket uh, here, go on ahead and check it here. Fighters approaching Arkham Asylum. I can't. I can play in it. I just can't win. Alright, Bat Boozy, you can go on ahead and call it. Alright, well, we can yeah. see Red Hood and Green Lantern. About to uh, go up into a quick uh, match. Oh, wait, what are we going to? First to three. First to three, alright, that sounds like a deal. And, um, as you can see, always going in with the beams. Jumps over. Um, actually, yeah, he's zoning them out quite well right now. Jumps over it, oh, but he couldn't close the distance quite enough. Grabs him, throws him over. Oh, and that's some good damage he's getting in already early on in the game. And as the wall is pushing up, oh yeah, he's got him in a bit of a shrink. That's his first uh, bar gun. And, oh dang, this uh, corner pressure is going pretty heavy. Oh, but he tries to get out, can't exactly get any distance off because Green Lantern is optimizing him. He's changing, he's changing him right now. Goes for the overhead. Oh yeah, the optimization is crazy right now. I think that's a killing combo, and that's over. Wait, no, yeah, yeah, that's death. Man, that's the first round pretty fast. I can see why you pick first to three. Begin. Round started. Yeah. yeah, he's doing the same zone and tech he was doing before. Oh, tried to jump in, but gets smacked in the face with another blast. Goes for an overhand, but can't seem to really hit them. Wait, should I? Uh, oh wait, never mind. I forgot. Never mind. Um, oh, and then he goes in for the overhead. Doesn't quite. Oh wait, no, never mind. That's that's a dead red hood right there. Oh, that's tragic. But as you can see, the next round goes up for another overhead. Um, yeah. Oh, dang! He's going for overheads, not just one overhead. He's trying to loop it in. Goes for the low. Gets a small combo off. A little tidbit. Oh, not Damn, actually, not good. a small combo. That was a good setup. I couldn't even block. I couldn't even figure out how to block that. Yeah, that's some weird mix. And that actually, that killed. That's it's that's game two. Fair. Kind of wild. He's mixing me really hard like when I ain't gonna hold it. Begin. Yeah, he's getting you right there. And Alright, yeah, he's got you with the first Oh, this time we didn't go for the zone and that much. He went actually went in on him. Green Lantern really solid. Actually, can't really block much of it at all, as it seems. Or right, he gets the guns in, that's actually some alright damage, but he's gonna have to do a little bit more than that if he wants to put any real damage in. Or right, he gets a BNB into first health bar. Uh, future looking bleak, but can't give up hope yet, as young Goku once said. But uh, he gets the kicks in. Oh, dang. 
And then that's a 25% going. Oh, dang. Every combo with Green Lantern seems to be getting almost 25% each time. Good and right here, he gets. Oh, actually, he was able to block that. I thought that move Green was quite Green minor Green. from the looks of it, but no. I thought so as well. Alright, that's game set point. And Green Lantern wins. That was quick first to three, honestly. Yeah. Ah. Uh, and that was look like pretty good games to me. All right, all right, GGs, Phoenix. I can go ahead and uh, head on back to new, select new fighter, or uh, back to main menu. Pop it in. Dang man. You're not wrong. That's a lot of knockdown pressure because I could barely even react to anything. Yeah, I couldn't tell whether he was, like, doing a reset right there, like, because sometimes he was, like, going for that little kick, and I wasn't sure if it was part of the combo or not. That was weird. Next, okay. So, Ryder, all right, tag in Ryder, and tag in Toast. All right, Gotham and Hoodie Hound, since you both, if you both are here, uh, I can go ahead and take you both now. All right, and Bat, if you're there, uh, the next proceedings is going to go on ahead and get through. That way we can actually spectate and commentate an actual match. Oh, uh, Bat, you there? Yes, I made it. Made it just in time. Okay, we're going to get ready to spectate and watch an actual match. Let's see how this one goes. Alright, we got Hoodie Hound and we got Gotham up Blue on Beetle. screen. Raid Bobby hop in Quinn. here. Alright, it's a first to three. Fighters approaching the shoe. Alright, first to three between Bla uh Hoodie Hound and I Gotham with Hoodie Hound playing Is that Blue Beetle? Blue Beetle, and then there's Harley Quinn. I and can't then, really tell by the skin, but it was, it was a bit weird. Again. I wasn't quite sure. And they're going to be playing on the Joker map. Uh, I haven't seen that one in a while. That brings my memories, but here we go in on the first round. We see him using the flying ability to get the first hit in. Jumps in for an overhead. Almost gets the mix, but he gets a block. Harley Quinn trying to get the distance, but can't seem to stop herself from getting hit. Back dash and starts throwing a little bit of projectiles. Isn't quite hitting the mark, but the... Wow, wow okay. And then he goes in for overhead, ducks under. Oh, the neutral game is crazy, but she can't seem to really get too much... Oh, let me not let me not say too much yet. She seems to be trying to get into it. I'm trying to wonder. Like, this is a, this is basically on ma matchup knowledge is the key here. Because yeah. Harley Quinn can zone Beetle out, but Blue Beetle can stay in here. Yeah. Blue like Beetle he, also like has a bit of zone. Yeah, like, but even, oh, dang. That's a bit of damage right there. That, I think they're like basically equal them out until right here. I think that's a bit of chip damage. I think she can get him out by chip damage if he doesn't move in. He moves in, actually. We'll try uh, over how ahead. delayed is it, Urban? The, yeah, it's, how, uh, how it's delayed up in the it? stream. Might have happened in the first game. Oh wait, they're probably spectating me. Oh man. Okay, so he goes in for the pistol shot. Oh dang. Knocks him down. I think that's yeah. That's twenty five percent on that's oh yeah, okay. Uh that's, oh, that's about to be a good it's about to be a good extra time. Oh never mind. Yeah. Alright, so that's a clash right there, actually. Those are quite uncommon, so I'm kind of surprised that happened. Uh, if you can... If you get it on the right move, you can clash on the right play. Yeah, I see Blue Beetle is, like, just putting in the work right now. She can't move to save her life for right now. Yeah, and that's the game. That's it. Oh, man. Alright, that's game one. That will go to...
We'll go to Harley Hoodie Quinn. Hound as the first Blue game. Beetle. All right, that's okay. Switches over to uh, wait. Blue Beetle? Oh wait, mm -hmm. Is it, are they switching? Oh yeah, All they right. did. To switch the map. Uh, wait, again. isn't the only thing that changes it are the interactables, right? Yeah, as the maps go on, you can interact with you can interact with map with things in the game or interact with the map. You can yeah. change maps whenever you want here. I don't maps don't really affect how the how the things go here as opposed to other games we've seen so far. Yeah. Okay. So that's actually um. Dang, this zone is probably gonna. Yeah, that's a long range of zone. Yeah, this is gonna be a kind of a tag match right here. Cause if he catches her, he can get some real good damage in. Oh, he, but he does actually start to get in, but he starts to get pushed back. Can't really get him away once he's already in, though. He seems to not be letting the Harley go anywhere. But I see keeps, Gotham is starts pressure, hitting back. Keeps the pressure on Harley. It's just gonna be hard, hard for Harley to get set up. Yeah, he. Yeah, I'll hit this. Oh man. All right. Wait. Um. I see that. Oh yeah, the corner pressure. I think that's a bar. And yeah. Now, now it's time to see what you're gonna do here now, cause you don't want to be stuck in the same pressure you were just a second. Ago. All right. But can't seem to quite get out the corner. Gets a bit of damage, but I mean, doesn't really help when getting grabbed. Oh yeah, the mix right there. That's about 50 percent. No, actually, a class saves. Uh, I think it saves a life, maybe. But, uh, the Clash was able to put a little bit more on. Yeah. I guess all the health you can get can help. It can. With Blue Beetle, his first I'm not, with, uh, against Blue Beetle, I'm not knocking it for Harley Quinn to have the extra bit of health. Because as you can see, once Jaime gets in, he it's hard to keep him out. Yeah. So she's got to she's got to stay zoning in order to try and keep keep some something going. Yeah, cause right now so he, she can't even jump in on him without getting completely anti-aired, and that's almost a life. But if she can pull an ultra instinct, maybe. And we got shipped out. Oh damn. Blue beetle wins. Game two. We'll go to the hoodie hound. Dang. See, we can make an adjustment. Harley Quinn, Blue Beetle. Fighters approaching the Joker's playground. All right, match point question mark. I'll put on some stuff yeah. here. So if you guys want, I'm good. we're going to have polls that are going to go up. So that way, if you guys wish to go on ahead and place your bets, go for it. Ooh. You said it right when the ad shows up too, which is kind of dumb. Oh, okay. It's a nice combo, I see that. It's pretty cool. It's, even without like that super high damage scale, it's still pretty neat. Oh dang, actually, yeah, that's like, she gave him an eye for an eye right there. Alright, bases are up now. If you guys want to go ahead and place your bet, polls are up now. Dang, that combo is just like melting away his health, and that's it. That's that's right there, that first health bar. And. Alright. Now it's starting to get spaced out a little bit. Instead of holding him in the corner. Oh, never mind, moving back in. It's like, uh, defend. It's like defensive, but also offensive at the same time, I guess. A little bit of a mix. Cause you can't really get too far away without getting punished, but oh, you can wow. like shoot him back. Oh, and dang, I think he's. Oh, he dropped it, but I think that's going in for a uh, pretty nice combo. And he's gonna keep him. I was gonna say he's about to keep him in the corner here, but we're getting out of harm's way. This is a good chance for Gotham, but this combo is gonna solidify the round. Be careful. Yeah. The drops are were low key helping him right there because he was getting some good damage off him each time he did it. 
But now it's just sort of become like if you drop another one, it might die. Oh, this is bad. He's trying to get the momentum going. Oh damn. Oh, we're not out of this just yet. Alright, one Quinn point will go to Gotham. Gotham's not out of this just yet. Harley Quinn yeah, with the clutch. Got ah, score I guess two so. to one in hoodies. If he can keep that up, this might become like one of those um Harley playoff Quinn. games where like just completely Blue reverses. There's a chance that scenario may happen. Fighters approaching Arkham Asylum. All right, polls for the next game are getting ready to go up now in 30 seconds. Begin. Uh, we'll see, Phoenix. If Gotham has adjusted, there is a chance Hoodie Hoodie Hound could be contested. Let's see here. Oh dang, goes in? Oh wow. That's pretty crazy, huh? Oh. oh, I thought that was gonna go into something different, but. Alright, let's see. Mm. I don't, I don't want to say anything. It's just like I can't tell who's really getting it. Oh yeah, I, I can see Blue Beetle trying to chip back. Mm -hmm. Hoodie Hound <laughs> is Blue Beetle right now, and Gotham is uh. Queen. Yeah, I know that. I was just like they were really like contested for a second, but as you can see, Gotham is starting to get in some good damage, trying to make the comeback. I see, but then. I see that uh, skill actually really good. That uh, with the hounds, are those hyenas? Yeah, those are hyenas, right? Yeah. Yeah, those are hyenas. And then gets in a pretty neat combo into that because if she can, uh, if Gotham can uh, back him up enough so that he can get uh, the hounds back up, he can easily start spacing them out. Oh, yay! Oh, that's gonna be a big deal of damage. I start. I mean, there's still hope. But like, I don't, I don't. Oh, never mind. He got his first bar right when I was about to say something. So this might. This, oh yeah, that's. Try not to try not to mark him off just yet, cause Harley Quinn. Not, was that punished? I don't know. Oh yeah, that roll right there got punished uh, for a big deal of damage. Blue Beetle kind of just spits it out, doesn't it? He can. <sighs> But then oh the drop gosh. goes into a reset. Is he making the comeback? I mean, will come back on a comeback? Is he coming back against the comeback? Prepare to be perforated. Uh, I'd rather he can't let himself choke right here, so the clash is gonna equal in some. Oh my gosh. Some health back. Oh. Ah oh, dang! All right. That was really close right there, but Gotham manages to get the second game and making it a tie. The second game, and now this is actually a match point scenario. Correct, Urban. This is two to two. All right, another poll getting ready to go. You know what this means? Harley Quinn, Aquaman. Harley Quinn. Ooh, we made the adjustment for matchup. Fighters approaching Red Sun Prison. Ooh, I haven't seen an Aquaman player in, like ever, so I want to see some more of this. We're switching out Blue Beetle for Aquaman. I seen it in the order of justice, but not this. They both feel about the same. Yeah. Oh, that's a great deal of damage he's doing right there. It's the trident throw in. Actually, I guess he can space him out with that like, character as well, so now it's a bit more. <laughs> he's saying I can beat you at your own game a little bit. But then right. polls are up now. Next it goes for the overhead. Unsuccessful one time, but gets it in the second. I mean I do a step backwards, but now he's got him in the corner. But somehow a weird side switch happened which caused roles to be reversed. Now Aquaman was trying to chip him out, but didn't happen quite exactly as he thought as Gotham is now breaking the bar. This is gonna be rough, bro. Oh, oh wait, I'm a bit behind. Um, and then okay, so 
That clash, I'm not actually sure who has the more but let me see right here. Um, yeah, I think Aquaman's gonna get a bit more back. Hoodie is gonna have to do. Oh, never mind. Gotham is on his. Low, oh, this is actually a little pretty fun. Yeah, cause he was jumping. I'm pretty sure when I got hit by that. All right, that's kind of crazy. So okay, it gets hit with the interactable, but actually starts to close down on this is with another interactable. It's a really close. It's getting pretty close right now, cause that combo's gonna take out at least 25%. I I think if I do no math. But um, goes in for the overhead. Actually, that's um almost dead, nearly. Good chip. It, yeah, that's actually a is that yeah, that's the comeback right there. That's the comeback. He went from got them, got them zero to from a, three from a two zero to a reverse question mark three zero. Hmm. I guess he said it. the first two games were just data and started going. That it can be. Thank you for tuning in to watch a different, something different here as we settle in here into the multiverse special event for Icon Lost in Justice. The collab idea with me and Relax and Blaze. Props to Relax and Blaze. I want him to be here to also co-commentary because it would be a lot more synonymous. Doctor Fate. But I will be sure to add him into this. All the same. Oh, dang. Okay, so talk, Dr. Fate and Green Lantern. This is going to be a good Dr. fight. I know Dr. Fate is pretty, pretty good as well. So this is bound to be something pretty interesting. Oh, Ryder, there you are. Uh, let me... See where I have you at right now. Ring beats helmet, Doc. Your ring cannot conquer fate. Alright, for the 20 viewers out there, thanks for tuning in to Iacon Lost in Justice for the Iacon 2 special here for... Thanksgiving in advance. Okay. If I didn't get a chance to say too early, I do apologize. So Urban's starting to do a little bit of setting up, but gets shot by Lost. This looks like a bad matchup, honestly, looking at this now. Yeah. Alright, so... See Fate starting to get in some, uh, some good damage, and really. Alright, bets are gonna get ready to go up. Uh, Ryder, That's about I'm trying to see where you're at now. I did give you the DQ left. earlier, but you're in... Losers bracket. Uh, I'm gonna send you the the bracket real quick, and bets are gonna go up in 30 -ish seconds. Can't seem to really get. Oh, never mind. Right when I said that, he starts to get in. That's a bit of damage, and that's about almost 50 percent. Not really. Not that there yet, but just about. Okay, I think that might be his first bar. Oh no, nope, never mind. Oh, oh, chip damage got him. Never mind. Both of them. Are well, actually both of them can chip, chip each other out, but I'm thinking like Doctor Fate can do this more than Green yeah. Lantern. Doctor Fate has a lot of really good options. Oh yeah, that's a lot. Of, that's a pretty good damage. Oh, right there. did oh did not know that hoodie. Wow. Oh dang. All right, so he's going. Oh, that's actually like. He's having a hard time just like touching him right now. <laughs> That's it, cause I mean, uh, I mean, not gonna lie, in the zoning game, yeah, Doctor Fate can get this, but it's just he needs to get in to actually make sure that Doctor Fate doesn't get started. Like so. Well, wait, did that beam go downwards Dr. toward? Uh, okay, so it like, has track. Is that All right, Urban will sure. take game one with Doctor Fate. That was actually kind of nice. Some clean cut zoning and combos. He like did a little bit of both in that game. It angles down Green the just, screen. Oh, couldn't really get in. Green Lantern. Uh, I will send you an invite. The um, the bracket is the your next round bracket is going to be Fighters coming up. Red if it isn't already in, in in effect, you can go on ahead and play if the opponent is here. I need to see what else is here, because uh, when we get to winner, the next one's Ring here in winners. Helmet, Doc. Invite to party. Your oh, okay. cannot conquer fate. Willpower covers fate. Begin. All right. Next round is match. Next bets are com are coming up now. Hang on.
going on. And uh, yeah, I can. Once this set finishes up, I can add you to uh, I can add you to my VC center. Man, man, Doctor Fate is really this. He's really just putting in the work. I haven't seen much of any of that before. It's just like that's about almost all of his bar. Uh, never mind his uh, circle ran right out. So I see Urban's just got that whole bar off real fast. I was like, excuse me. I guess I shouldn't have. I guess you can't really look away when you're fighting Dr. Fake, can you? You can? Oh, uh, dang. Okay, so he's starting to fight back now. He's starting to get in a bit more damage. But Fake. Oh, never mind. Fake couldn't quite stop him from hitting him with the armor move right there. I agree. And if you can get one more mix in, that's the bar. Yeah. It's good to be green. Uh, hang on, uh, Gotham's gonna get ready to pop up the next thing of bracket here real quick. Starting to set up some more of his um, cross it with uh, simple. It's awesome. Much easier to remember. Um, Green Lantern, he's pretty low, so he's gonna have to be a little bit more careful. But he starts Whoa. to get into a little bit of mix up. Yep, that's uh, yeah, that's a dead Lantern right there. Dr. Fate wins. And Urban takes game two. And we're going to be going on to uh, see what could be match point. If we land it into round three. Alright, I'm going to go. I was getting ready to finish up and send this out here, but I'm going to just go ahead and just put the poll here for round three Dr. in Fate. advance. Alright. See? Try and see what you can do with the matchup knowledge. Green Lantern. You got a zoner against a zoning god, essentially, what it looks like here. So we gotta pick the the right. Fighters call. approaching the bat cave. Oh, and Ryder, thank you for the gift of sub. I appreciate you, man. Go ahead and take your vote vote here. Winner of round three, bets are up now. Begin. Okay, he starts to get a bit of damage in. Nothing really too game changing yet. But then Green Lantern starts to get in the meter burn into a pretty big combo. This could mark the turn of a comeback, but no, then Dr. Face starts to space him out. Can't exactly get him away from him, but that doesn't really mind Dr. Face. He can just push him back again. Uh, okay, they going in. As you can, oh, yeah. There's Urban's combo. Oh, never mind. It goes down, but he can keep blocking afterwards. Get some the first bar in, and Urban trying to make sure that um, yeah, he's got to get in there. Do what you got to do to get in there. Got to stop Doctor Fate from rolling. Yeah, because once he starts the setup, it's kind of hard to even like. It's hard to stop him. Back away, don't back away, that's what he wants. Yo, yeah. use the environment. So he uses the... Right. I don't think that's gonna be quite enough. Yeah, that's pretty low, but... If he can get a good hit and he can get the first bar on. Oh, damn, he missed that. He needed that. He could've got the round to reset. Oh, never mind, he did. Oh, yeah, the lantern shot right there was able to get him. Yeah, the corner. All right, yeah, the corner the combos will be a bit more. Oh, never mind. He drops it, but keeps going for a bit more damage. Takes him out of the corner. Interesting choice, but now he has to deal with Doctor Fay's corner pressure. Damn. There's nothing to joke about. Dang, that's the thing right there, actually. Doctor Fay wins. Get past the pressure. Game match and... point will go to Doctor Fate and the Urban JP. Damn, that's another good game, but I ain't gonna lie, that matchup, the zoning matchup with Fate seems to be hard. It's like you, like he's a zoner that you definitely don't want to get going. You don't want him to get going once he gets, once he gets started. Yeah, cause once he gets some symbols out after he starts zoning, it's just like he has his own pressure. He can use it any sort of time. 
be in voice chat and then it should be to share all or share to just this uh this party oh all right until i can pop it on here manually viewers uh this I right now is the, uh, makes it audible Arlene this right now is the current Green bracket manager. outline as it is Voice shared. Okay, you should be able to hear me now. All right, Gotham is going with Fighters approaching Condock. Harley Quinn and Wong is going with Green Lantern. Yeah. Begin. Seems like a pretty good fight right here. Huh? All right, I'm gonna switch over this command here. I'll let you guys go ahead and do the commentary. Check this out. All right. So then, oh, I'm pretty sure she's moving in, but she can't really get out. It's starting to get hits in. But, um, can't seem to get too much damage in without abiding by some of his pressure as well. Does get a bit of chip in. Um, going in, but the hounds are actually starting to push, but can't really get anything in when the Atlanta is actually, like, actively punching her in the face. Basically. Oh, and then the interactable into a bigger combo. That was actually kind of nice. Oh, and that's the bar gone right there. I feel like I've seen this matchup a few different times. I just don't know where I've seen it. I thought we had this one. Was this the first matchup? Uh, no, that was um Harley and Vita. Oh, okay. Sorry, that's the some of the skins look similar. I don't know, just different colors. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just like... <laughs> I don't know. Oh, dang, the hound just like straight up teleported in there. I saw that. <laughs> I've never seen like them just spawn in. Okay, now the bracket is set to go. Starts so to now... go in. That's a bit of damage right there. Um, right, brackets are up now. Actually, Gotham's kind of looking a little bit... Um, what's kind the word? Vulnerable? I was going to say okay, stuff, but... but that works as well. Yeah, and then he starts going out. Yeah, huh? Uh, Gotham, you might want to try to like. Oh wait, I, I meant to say he's trying to get back, but actually, yeah, that's a bit of health for a governed, But he's gonna have to make sure he doesn't get caught in another combo. Or that might be game. Uh somehow the hound didn't. Sort of just uh, he got the jumping. Oh, I love that very combo. Slick. Oh, that. Uh, yeah, that's that's gone. That's. I mean, wait. Never mind. No. Okay, that should be about almost dead, but yeah, a little bit of chip left. All right, Got Phoenix will by. take game one. Green Lantern wins. Put this on in here. Phoenix will take game one. Also, for you guys that are sitting out here watching, definitely be sure to support the Matcherino. There is a Matcherino in play for this event. So if you guys want to contribute, by all means, definitely contribute. Harley Quinn. That is going to be Green this Lantern. current one here. Fighters approaching Slaughter Swamp. Bah. That's not it. Hang on. Copy. All right, Macherino here. That's the Macherino for Icon Lost in Justice. Definitely see if we can get that up and going and support the players that Second did show round. up here tonight. In order to try and see if they can win themselves some good stuff here and win themselves a decent prize. And they're the bows and overheads. Probably just starting to push them back. I mean, Goss in front of us. So I'm trying to get used to not saying the character name. But, oh, he has some pretty good damage. Got him almost to the corner. Yeah, that's there, right in there. Now it's time to see if he got the mid health. Never mind, gets shot out, but. I'm gonna try to move out the corner. It successfully moves out the corner. Now he's reversed the situation here. Got him almost out oh, of his I bar. Like yeah, that's that him out of like that Nice angle. movement on Gotham's part and pushes Green Lantern backwards. I mean, let's call him Phoenix. Yeah, Phoenix. Moving in. Actually, well, actually, no, that's the other side right there. 
I see. No, cause okay, there. Exactly Elvis, what's going on? on? Welcome, welcome to the Injustice Tournament. Yo, I was that you. Elvis? Yeah, but I, that way, yeah, let me yes, focus. Sir. I don't want to get too caught up on <laughs> Elvis. <here. laughs> I'm on the distracting for the game. Um, but uh, damn, oh, he's right. in a tough spot. Phoenix he could got the bar. Hmm, nice challenge. That seems to be. Yeah, that's a bit of health bed, actually. And... Um, yeah, I, I was... Uh, I, I was getting used to the pets, actually. Starts to get him into the... Uh, the Phoenix gets him into the corner, but... Gotham is trying to push him back so it doesn't actually cost him the game. Gets some good damage and basically takes away all the healthy recovery. And then the hound comes to his life. Uh, comes oh, to save is, his life. This is so close. Oh man, Gotham that's yeah. This is really up. close. But he's got to hold the line. They both have one bar. So this might end up a little bit weird. Yeah. And Gotham does take it. And Gotham Harley gets Quinn his round back. That. Harley Quinn doesn't man. want him. Uh, doesn't want to lose in front of Elvis. <laughs> 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 Honestly. All right, and for those of you guys keeping track, score is presently one to one. Harley in Quinn the match. Up. Green Lantern. Let's see what we're going to this. Fighters approaching the Joker's playground. Hmm. Not quite sure. Yeah, the Joker's playground. There won't be that many interactables on this one. Exactly. Alright, for those of you guys here that are definitely tuning in to Icon Lost and Justice, I appreciate you guys. Support the match arena as you can, so that way we can get this going. I want to at least try and see if it can crack a dollar or so. Still got a ways to go. We're at 53 cents. Kind of zone each other out, but Green Lantern tries to move in, but Harley was ready, but not ready enough for the beam. Bets are going up in 30 seconds. As this okay is insane. Is there a um... Never mind. Wait, the match arena is... Is it, is it a command? Is it like game match arena? Um, it is, but I also have it individually right now. Because all the other match arenas that are listed there are events that are already there. That's why I didn't want to confuse the rules. I think I did it, but... Alright, and then Phoenix goes in, takes the bar from Gotham. And this is gonna be an interesting match. See if they can break the tie. All right, bets are up now. Oh, that was nice. Got the corner somehow evaded the beam. Uh, that one. See if he can free himself from the pain that is getting zoned out by the Green Lantern. Actually, he does with the Hound. Um, There's gonna be some rough zone. Yeah, because he's at the back of the map with the Green Lantern, so he's obviously gonna be. <laughs> Let's say we just duck and it go, literally goes right above. That. You love a good, good meter. Never on the first day. Oh, actually, yeah, this could possibly save his life. Use it real correctly. Oh yeah, and that's um, 25% regain. This should be pretty good opportunity for him to save his own life. Oh, but no, he Damn. gets hit with the combo, and that's the game right there. That's 2-1. That is a 2-1 situation. Phoenix takes game two. I'm not going to count out Gotham just yet. Harley Quinn still has a lot more bags. Of, has, has a lot yeah, more tricks in which to utilize. Let's see if the comeback machine is still worrying, because he did it Green last time. Turn. Maybe he might get it off Harley again. Quinn. It's always possible. Fighters approaching Arkham Asylum. Uh, hey, did you, um, get the, did you get the link? Rodimus, can you get this one? Cause I'm uh, had to get some real quick. Go for it. All right, let's see what happens here. Oh, this is bad. This is a a good starting at first but it looks like Phoenix is adjusting to Harley's neutral outline
those of you guys interested, definitely seek to try and support the Matcherino as we're going here. Pop it back in here again for the Matcherino. As we tune in here for the continuation of the matchup outline here for the Green Lantern and the Harley Quinn. And Phoenix is keeping this pressure. He's keeping this corner, that's for sure. Uh, if you don't have PayPal, that's fine. Would you, however it is you're able to donate if you wish, or if that's what you seek to do, by all means, go for it. Oh, whoa, wait a minute now, hang on. Oh, I love that combo. Just like that, Phoenix to the left. Eater burn. Learn to take a joke, pal. Uh, is it like a short play or are y'all just in the room to kind of uh, they are like I'm actually in a in a clo in a a special in a specific uh King of the Hill. Okay. You can uh, if you want, you can invite me to that and I can I can help you call it. Call. I like. I know a little bit about injustice. All right, and that is game set point. All right. Phoenix will take that over Gotham three to one. A good. All right. Next. Uh. All right. Before we get started, so wait, in... did did Phoenix win the um, the uh, yes. last game? Yeah. Yeah, that was three to one. So that secures winners' finals. And let me update the brackets here for um, losers' bracket. And wait. Get that, oh, dang! Get they get lost your home. pizza. How did they lose your pizza? They just like <laughs> they cooked it. They're like, where'd it go? Damn. Yeah, I'm so sorry, oh, man. Pizza. That pizza never had a chance to be loved. Right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. His whole, uh, your family. He has a family waiting for it back at home, and it's gone. That fucking pizza. His whole life was just over, man. Or before yeah. it even started. All right. So let me. All right. Actually, um, hoodie hound. Let me. Um, if you still have my invite, you can go ahead and join back real quick. Uh, and then we can have our match here in losers round three. Bro, oh, Rodimus, you're playing in it too? And then I'm going to go on ahead and what I'm going to do is turn the attention back to winner's finals, loser's quarterfinals, semifinals, and loser's finals. I'm going to feature both. I'm going to feature both those brackets. So that way it covers, that top, it covers top eight structurally. 